Hey, welcome back. So I just wanted to do this real quick video and get it get it posted. Uh, I want to address just a couple things. Number one, I've been getting the question a lot, do I offer consulting services? Absolutely I do. You can contact me through YouTube. You can send me an email at willie, W-I-L-L-I-E, at H-O-W-E-X, the number five, dot com. Or you can cruise on over to my website, www.howx5.com, and grab my phone number off there. Contact me that way. I do offer consulting, and I have uh, or do have clients all around the globe. So feel free to reach out, and we'll see if we can help you out with your problems. The second thing is uh, I am going to probably double post videos today. So tonight, that Wi-Fi security part two will be posted, but I wanted to get this out there. And then the third thing is, somebody pointed out that when I did the 5.2 beta video, I didn't cover, I talked about the addition, but we didn't actually look at it. So real quick, we want to talk about those rate controls. So you're going to log into your controller, and you're going to go to settings, wireless networks, and then you are going to pull up the, the wireless network. And down here, at the bottom we've now got this 802.11 rate and beacon controls and this is where you can actually control which uh, speeds you are going to to allow on your your access points and DTIM basically it's your your beacon um, and this so this is how often those beacons are are set out so this, what you're seeing, is actually the default. I haven't changed this at all. Um, so we click Legacy. You can see it changes some of those settings. Or we can do Totally Custom. Or we can go back to Default. So get in there, play around with these. You can do the same thing. So the 2G, that's obviously 2 gigahertz. 5G is 5 gigahertz. You can also adjust that, that beacon period. So you know, get in there, play around with it. I'm going to say that if you've got a device that can only negotiate at 5.5 meg and you don't you don't allow that then you could see some some connection issues so get in there this is one of the new features if you've got any questions post them in the comments cruise on over to the ubiquity community http colon slash slash community dot ubnt dot com if you like the video please subscribe please give, please give a thumbs up please comment and share and now we'll see you at the next Wi-Fi security video.